Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, like I said, to part 42 of Let's Play Europe Universalis for Baharat on the Dahama expansion. I, like I said, you're going to get two parts today, and this is the second of those parts. Uh, in the last part, we... Yeah, I don't know why I did that was hours ago. Fucking... It doesn't really matter. Uh, in this part, we're going to uh, be hopefully keeping stable, finishing off... Hope, Hopefully... If we take this, they'll uh, Ottomans will be like, ah, fuck it, have this. Like they're, they're just like they'll be like, we don't we don't care anymore, just have it. Um, because honestly, that would fucking just make my life so much easier. Like just just so much easier. But uh, yeah, no, the game doesn't like making my life easy. What am I on about? We're gonna get an alliance with Yemen. I don't know why. I've just suddenly decided we're going to. So uh, I did. Um. Yeah, so we could probably do some Delhi killing. Uh, we, might, we might just wipe out Delhi this part. Um, uh, try and do some shit on Pegu as well. We'll see. We'll see. If we did something against Pegu, we'd have to fight Ming. Ming is a technological beast. No matter what fucking get like, no matter, no matter what let's play I do, Ming. If I'm not Ming, is usually just a fucking beast. Since the um, oh fuck, what was the deal? I can't remember the expansion that upgrade, uh, did them, uh, upgraded them, but well, the expansion that was in East Asia. Um, but, but since then, they've just been fucking OP. It's it's brilliant. It's it's brilliant. It legitimately, it's brilliant. Like I'm I'm honestly glad they fucking happened. But at the same time, fuck you. Like you you've made them technologic technically. You just made them fucking you a Western country over. Like they're basically just a Western country. You hardly ever see them not on light green. So it's... Yeah, it's one of those situations. Um, I don't think Ming and, Ming and I share any... No, we, we legitimately are only... like This is where my province is, yeah. So we, we, we've agreed on a border, essentially. So that's good. Um, I don't need to put this money into a loan, do I? No, I don't. So this money is officially mine that I can spend. Uh, let's get some fucking more manufacturers. Manufacturers are useful as fuck. Um, getting in the, getting some, um, ooh, uh, oh, fuck, what the god, uh, universities, we need to get some universities as well. Um, uh, how many provinces around this? We've got, what is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So six would be enough. So I've got three, four, five. So all I'd just do is take these two or two more and I'd have this would be my color. So that's good to know. Um, right. What do I want to do? I would love to invest in military tech. That's uh, one of the few things I would love to do. We are pushing for uh, uh, to finish this. So I get, uh, I don't have as many problems with um, the heathens because... We don't like heathens. And right now, we kind of need to like heathens. One thing I'm going to do is turn off uh, my money, so I'm just minting heavily. Because, uh, actually, I do need to upgrade... I, I do need to build up these guys to at least level 4. Um, I can get rid of you, so I'm going to get rid of you. Uh, so have a look at... I'm not, I'm not really in... I, I don't think this campaign is really going to be the same, like, fort... BS that I did in the last one, but I could do that. Mm, nah, we're gonna hold off of that. Oh shit, yeah, we need to get these up as well because they'll they'll help the spread of uh, institution and they'll make me tr my trade better as well. So everything uh, in my capital node needs to do that, and we've got these done, which is great. Let's go explore. Um, what sea is this? Uh, it's region-wise. That is the Southwest Pacific. Go find me the islands I want to colonize. We found one of them. So we just need to find the rest. Because if we don't find them, someone's going to colonize them. It'll, it'll upset me. Does look like there's uh, the Indians, like some uh, Dillian separatists who are just gonna go run wild because I don't think uh, I don't f I actually don't think they could, uh, the Timberids can get because they can't because I have full access around it. So this territory, I may all revert back to Delhi because they may not be able to hold it, which honestly would be fucking hilarious to watch. 
Um, so yeah, you know, what? I hope I kind of hope that happens. Just just because it'd be funny. Uh, we can nearly have a third army, a new sorry not a third army, a ninth army I think it is. Um, I'm actually just gonna make it anyway. I'm gonna because I'm. I'm low on armies in my opinion. Like I, I need a, I need a new army because I've got two armies less over here than I had before. Mostly because uh, we don't tolerate animus. So once we start tolerating them, I may be able to like withdraw as many, some of my forces. But we'll have to wait and see. Where the fuck is my navy? Oh, it's gone down here first. So it's the Africans who have colonized down here. Interesting. Oh fuck yeah, we got New Zealand as well. Completely forgot about that because I just no one's. It's, it's so empty over here. Like Europe, I don't know what the fuck Europe's doing, but they're just not doing anything. Like well, look at all of all of this, bar this, which I don't think actually. If we look at, yeah, that is colonial Caribbean, but pretty much all of the Caribbean is under fucking like the the British Cubans, the British Cubans. That's insane. You hardly ever see that happen. And here we go. And someone, some twaff. So to sue, sue some more, uh, sown some more discontent. It's only what well, you can only do one set of discontent. I hope like you can't. Not two people can't just dis sow you discontent because that would be, oh, that'd be problematic for me. Like that'd be problematic on so many levels. Like all of the levels. That that'd just be horrid. Really wish I could get the count out. So, you know, what? we're actually gonna start building. Universities because I, I need universities for when um, for when we finally have to uh, you know embrace the institution like starting by like getting there yeah starting to get the institution so like on a matter of safety sake it's safer safer if we have at least like three or four done um, because it, then it will spread really quickly. If we just spend all of our money on it now, then we'll be fine. In 93, we can ask for some more money. Um, I can't really give us any, get us any more money than we've already got. You know what, we're just going to do normal. We could circumnavigate the globe, apparently. I, I don't see why the fuck I would do that. Um, I've got, like, a massive block to do before if I wanted to do that. And to be honest, I don't think we'd get very far anyway without, without dying. Looks like Savoy was granted some land. I don't know if they've been granted land, but they always seem to take one random province. Um, province history. Was chartered between Diaviet and Diaviet. No, there was... There must. There was definitely a war, apparently. I don't see how it could have... There could have been, but apparently there was a war. I mean, you tell me, guys and gentlemen, you tell me, because I have no fucking clue at the moment. Right, we need one in the capital, just, just because safety's sake, and then we need one in Delhi. We want some in the bigger cities, so we can, um, like, um, it gets quicker, like, we get, we can basically just pay it off. So we'll use this map mode to figure out, um, like, actually, if we click on them, apparently it shows some of the, it shows our richest ones, like... Yeah, these guys over here. And we, if we get them, um, then we're golden. Finally, the improved relations. That's fucking beautiful. 3.8. It's only the Ottomans I give a fuck about it being on anyway. Like, everyone at this point, I've stopped caring. Not, like, not because I couldn't. I don't, I don't want to care, but just because at this point, it's pain in the ass caring. Right, a development map. It's this one, I believe. Well, that's green by, like, actual standard. So, yeah, that definitely needs to be done. Um, then Gorgunt. Actually, no, up here. For, fucking hell, that's a good one. Nice 36 up there. Uh, yes, yeah, so we've got loads of places where we can do it. We should be fine. Like, legitimately, we should be fine. Uh, current government reforms. We are... 89 is when we're going to get our political absolutism. Which... Honestly, it's just gonna be fucking awesome. Uh, like, uh, currently, our like it's uh, absolutely is doing as a fucking glorious amount of stuff. Like that extra administrative efficiency is going to cheapen cause, and just in the long run, help us out a lot. Now, I am thinking about going to Wobadeli, and by thinking, I mean I am ready to go to Wobadeli. So we're gonna we're gonna get that done. Uh, we'll uh, we'll help their suffering by giving them forty gold. 
Yep, because now uh, Papua New Guinea. Papua is mine, or Papua New Guinea. Uh, there you put one there. Uh, let's explore the Southwest Pacific. I want to get all of this fucking shit found as far as I can. Congo is you is under is still in the Central African. Did, did are you a babbling buffoon? That's acceptable then. I'm gonna say you don't insult your fucking leader, especially when your leader's the like your like the overlords, the one who gives you all your money, gold, and that. You're in the wrong place. Luckily, we need another month anyway, so it's all good. Uh, we'll do. We'll take it. We'll just take it for that. There we go. There we go. And we'll uh, then annex these guys, and then oh shit, they got an army through. They must have built one. Because they shouldn't have been able to get an army through. Because I own literally everything around it. I don't think I'm, I think their army died, but still, it, it, like I don't, I didn't think they would be able to get one through. It don't matter. So I just want to annex you, and then I want all of your gold too. So, because yeah, like, like as we say, or as we know, that that's just, just, just who the fuck is your ally? Mong Yang. Oh, I can actually invade these people as well. That's fucking brilliant. I'm just gonna send forces straight over to do that. All right. Eventually, we'll uh, we'll fit into our little gap, so it'll be good. Oh, Mong Yang, you're gonna give me all your money too, which is gonna be seventy-five. I mean, I'm still going to take it, don't get me wrong, but what can you do? Now, while we're waiting, let's get uh, that there. I'm trying to separate them. I'm trying to get them around as well. Like, I'm try who who gives me money? It's you. You, you, you give me money, so I'm going to have to do this one. Because I need them to be able to give me money. You know what, let's do that. Raise war tax for two years. Let's get a little extra money coming in. Explore the west. Whatever sea that is, just fucking go explore it. Alright, once we've done with all this, we'll, uh, we'll have loads of fun. To be fair, we'll probably wait. We'll probably let, like, turn all our men off as well after this. And we'll, uh, you know, just have a little bit of time... But we're still at war, but we're not, like, doing anything until the, uh, raised war taxes runs out. Yeah, Saxony, you, you, so, so boy, you seem to just be getting land in, like, places. How, how are you doing this? I need to play, I haven't played as a European nation, though, since uh, they uh, they did the new patch, so. I mean, that might help me figure out how the fuck they're doing it. You can go back to there. Uh, you'll get there 26. I get here on the 27th. So, yep. There we go. You're fucked. Thank you for uh, being fucked. Um, you, we couldn't have uh, fucked you without, yourself, fuck, without you fucking yourself. Uh, it's. I don't know where the fuck you came. You were, so I'm going to put you in Kotuk for now. All right, you. I don't actually want your land, so I'm just gonna, you know, do everything I can to you, because fuck you. And now we'll root out the cro root out the rock because I don't want to do anything else. We're gonna uh, now we're gonna turn off our infantry and just mint for a bit. Turn off the forts. There we go. We'll mint until. Uh... So let's uh, click on the development map mode again. Yeah, worth having. Cossack as well. Got to make sure that all these buildings are built in places that will, uh, when when like when they're finished, like it'll actually benefit us. Because if it doesn't benefit us, then it's a waste of our time. Love to get this tax fin this ta uh, economic ideas finished, but we also need to get tech as well. So I don't even yeah we're not even like current on military tech. So right now we're a bit behind. Let's uh, figure out the next place. Uh, we done one here. 
We have not. Let's get that done. So they'll be spread out quite a bit, um, which will be good because it means that we're getting multiple places that are getting it straight away, uh, which just in the long run is good for us. And in a couple of months, we'll have our uh, reform. And uh, we'll be good. The uh, political absolutism, just fucking, just it's beautiful. I, I'm, I'm honest. I honestly can't wait for it. It's uh, just gonna be. You're not. I can't be bothered waiting for you, Dallas. So we're just gonna annex you. Because I'm still gonna earn about the same money, probably. Well, there goes my admin that I was going to use for humani humanitarian, humanitarian stuff. Right, so where's the... Uh... Apparently this one... All right, wait, wait. Yeah, Assam. We'll do Assam. And we'll do wherever the fuck that was. Because I actually have no clue where that was, so... And for some reason, I have a second mercenary. Wait, 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 the conquest of where? Is it here? Oh, I don't know. And now we can enact it, ladies and gentlemen. So let's read them. Political absolutism. The best of the state is served uh, through the realization of the plans and will of its monarch. A true and enlightened monarch can unite, uh, utilize its full capacity to undertake the many changes needed to ensure prosperity. Legislative house. By separating the legislative body into more than uh, one house then more, more than one house we better, can better balance the need for change with the one uh, with the need to conserve and preserve the tradition of old become monarch uh, become republic so monarchy has run its course in this country it is time to reform the government at its, at its very top and institute a republic with elector electable leaders and then freer it's all theocratic government religion is the only true viable way to judge and right and wrong let us reform the government in its very core and have the divine guiders from now on. But no, we're going to choose political absolutism. There, we've done. We've uh, we've enacted all of them. So we can actually. I think I want to change states general to like parliamentary. Let's think else. Because as fun as this is, I mean, we could get. I mean, we could get that production efficiency or parliamentarism. It costs uh, 10 corruption, no, that, that would actually fuck us up for quite a while, so we'll, we'll not touch this. Um, okay, James, have fun. I mean, you, you're going to have to be upset with me, because uh, you ain't getting... Whoa, wait, wait. Oh, sh wait, three slots. No, that's not... Fuck it, I'll just assume that it's good. Um, well, I can't actually say no to that, so... Retreat for a minute, retreat for a minute, everyone else get to the fucking border. Right, you get there, you get there. I knew that fucking twat was gonna come straight for my men. Get some diplotech while we're waiting. Let's get a mover on there. Wait, no, no, ah, oh, fuck, I've already set that emotion. I was try I was about to say, no, don't set that emotion to myself, but I did. The killing of this, uh, the rebels was, I mean, it's kind of a politically stupid move. Well, it's not politically stupid, it's just fucking stupid. Was I promised land? I don't think I was. That's going to be quite upsetting if I wasn't promised land. Because then I actually have to do stuff. And doing stuff sucks. I'm going to have to tell you to fuck off because you're, rebe you're a rebellious element. And I do not need a rebellious element at the moment. So if you would kindly fuck off. Maybe you can go get there now. Uh, I'm going to push this fort over because fuck you and your fort. Same there. Fuck you and your fort. If we can siege all this up be golden for the first time ever i'm gonna have to ignore you because i don't i, I need the money for you know for, for once mu stability isn't as important as what i could buy with the money what i could buy with the money is is too fucking precious 
You're upset with me. We're going to patronize you uh, so you can keep construction costs on the cheap. Because I don't personally like paying a lot for construction. Exploration finished. Let's send you on another. To the Northeast Pacific. Look at that fucking beautiful line that's about to be ruined. Yep, still going to... I'm going to put myself backwards now. There we go. And you're done as well. So let's get you up here. So we're about to have sieged all of this shit up. Which gives me only a 40% like part of this war because I didn't kill an army. But unfortunately, I'm going to have to end this part. I hope you guys have enjoyed. And I'll see you guys next part. See you guys then.